Kim. And hi, everybody. Welcome to On the Red Carpet with me, Melissa D. Gordon. Uh, I'm debuting my new show today, and I'm so happy to be back on air for my show. I'm just, it, it, I'm just really happy. So uh, you're uh, On the Red Carpet live with Melissa D. Gordon with Anthony Quinones for one and only Bariqua Passe. Woo! I love it. And I met Anthony. Anthony and I, um, I met him uh, during a wonderful uh, time with the Aquarius boys. See, Lisa Lisa was there, Grandmaster Flash, Melly Mel was there, and my all-time favorite also is Ice Tea and Coco. So here we are with Bar uh, Bariqua Passe, Anthony Quinones. Uh, yes, yes, we're live on SDI Radio. Uh, for, all those, for all the listeners that are tuned in right now, uh, big shout out to Melissa Gordon on the red carpet. Um, Yes, I was at the I was at the Aquarius Boys party, and uh, Ice T, Coco, uh, Miss Melissa Gordon was there. A lot of great hip hop legends were in attendance that night, and I know. Um, it was a great yeah. evening, industry wise. You have this radio station. Tell us a little bit about yourself, where you're from, and uh, how you got into the music industry. Uh, for those that don't know me, my name is Anthony Quinones, also known as uh, Boricua Pasi. Uh, wow, uh, where do I start? Uh, <laughs> 26, 26, I just hit my 26th year uh, as an artist, and it's been and it's been an amazing time for me uh, as an artist to be able to share the stage. I've been on stage just about with everybody you can think of, from hip-hop, freestyle, salsa, merengue, reggaeton. I've wow. been on stage with just about everybody you can think of, except some of the new, new, new artists that are coming out now, but it's been an amazing time for me, and... Um, I recently was uh, nominated the ambassador of music for the National Puerto Rican Day Parade in New York in Yonkers, June 3rd. So Sunday, June 3rd, I am the ambassador of music for the Yonkers Puerto Rican Day Parade, bringing Yonkers some flavor. Yonkers, uh, you know, uh, the Yonkers Puerto Rican Day Parade needed, needed me to come down there and make some noise. So I have a great lineup of artists that are going to be performing uh, for that day as well. Actually, gonna do. I'm actually doing a concert. I normally just do like a one song, two song set, but I'm doing a full concert. So this is okay. something that I. This is something that I do very rarely. Every ten years, I'll do it. So I'm okay. doing it this year. And uh, as far as the artistry part is concerned, um, I worked 15 years for the VIP record pool in the Bronx. Um, I handled their feedback sheets and stuff for Al Pizarro. And uh -huh. then I started, uh, I started as a dancer, uh, believe it or not, because I used to be a dancer and a choreographer. So started as a dancer, uh, danced with a lot of the freestyle legends, you know, a couple of them. And then from there, did my own thing, you know, and Boricua Posse is here. So I love oh, it. Graciously, graciously speaking, um, you know, once uh, Strictly Rhythm Records uh, folded, uh, the original content of the music, of course, cannot be done again. Uh, so forces me into a, um, you know, forced me to do a nice, beautiful remix, which I have no problem with performing. And anybody that's seen me perform, uh, they already know I'm, I'm maybe no, 51 I years old, but I'm like a little young guy, a young guy on stage. So, you know, <laughs> Half your yes. fans are all watching right now. What do you have to, what do you have to say? To yes. A lot of people are watching right now. Yeah. Um, as far as my listeners are concerned, let me see here. I got the Bronx, Brooklyn, Queens, Manhattan, Long Island, Staten Island, Yonkers, the United Kingdom, Brazil, wow. Germany. I got Red Cranston, Rhode Island. I got Atasca, Illinois. I got Wisconsin, Jersey City, See? Patterson, New Jersey. A lot of people are listening in right oh, now. You have a book coming out. Yes, I do have a book coming out. Um, nice. I have a book coming out and a movie, not just oh. a book. Yeah, okay. so I'm oh. I'm actually almost finished writing the book. And I can't disclose the title of the book right now because we're still working on the title part. I'm I'm stuck between three different titles, so that's where I'm okay. at. But the book's almost finalized. I'm on my 220th page, and I should be. Uh, I, I, my cutoff is 350. You're involved with the entertainment company, Big Daddy Entertainment. Tell us. Big Daddy company. Entertainment. Yes, yes. Big Daddy Entertainment. We are a Jersey City. The, the company's the origin of the company is from Jersey City. We are a company dedicated to lupus awareness and we've we've done things like go to the hospital uh we have a lupus walk every year Pase, 80s 90s what year 91 91 circa 91 okay. uh remix done in 97 
So I've actually hit my 20th year with the remix, you know, but uh, on stage, uh, 26 years, you know, and it's been wow. amazing. I love it, you know, and I, I, I live for this, you know, um, I'm one person off stage and another person on stage. And anybody that knows me personally knows the transformation that I go through from artist to, to man, from man to artist. I'm somebody else when you give me a microphone. You've uh, played with some of the most uh, amazing, uh, also talented people. Uh, who is your favorite to perform with? Um, to be honest with you, my my most memorable experiences on stage have been with the Salsa Legends. Oh, I love salsa music. No, no disrespect to any of the other genres or artists that I've ever performed with or continue to perform with. But my experiences with the salsa bands have been a lot more memorable for me because um you know when when you're in when you're in club music like I'm I'm in, you know I'm considered a Latin club music artist you know although it's Latin it doesn't necessarily mean you're going to always be around Latin groups bands so on and so forth right. so when I've hit the stage when I've told you that I did the Palladium one year I'm coming oh. up the stage to go perform and I got Celia Cruz and Tito Puente Senior coming down the stairs. It was like the most amazing thing. And, um, you know, big shout out to Tito Puente and Tito Puente's family who have been, we've been very good friends for a very, very long time. And it's just been an amazing journey for me. I I'm, I was going to retire last year and I had put it out there that I was going to retire. And everybody, no, don't retire because I have a hot new song. So everybody's like, you don't want to retire right now. So, you know. And I'm going to play it for you guys because, you know. I can't hear it. Let's take a listen. Yes. I'm Mr. Boricua Posse. We're here live on SDI Radio. This is Boricua's Playhouse. Yeah, it's Midday Mayhem live from Boricua's Playhouse. Yeah, Midday Mayhem live from Boricua's Playhouse. Radio station, SDI Radio. Yes, that's my new song, Woo! The Glamour. I love it. Oh my gosh, everybody, that was that awesome thumbs up. On I love to keep asking me, is that really you? And I have to tell them, of course, it's me. Who else is going to be? So, you know, I still I still deal with that on an occasional basis, you know, I time to time. A lot of music now is digital, and a lot of people's voices are digital these days. Okay. But I don't do that. Anybody that goes to any of my shows know. I leave horse because I perform live. So, and, and I and, and you know what? It makes me feel like I, I, you know, I I used to be a Zumba instructor, and that would be a great track to give Beto Perez because uh, you Zumba instructors out there, that was an amazing song. Pick it up from uh, definitely uh, Anthony Quinones Boricua Passe. I hope it's I said on, that right. My, the song is available on iTunes. Um, it is available on iTunes and other download uh, markets and stuff okay. like that. So it is available. Big piece, but my big piece of advice to everybody that's trying to make any kind what of music happened? is stop putting your whole song on SoundCloud. Stop right. putting your whole song to be heard anywhere. Right. So you put, you put a snippet out there, a 35-second right. snippet, and if your fans are really yours, they'll buy it. They'll buy it. Bingo. Okay. That, and that, that reminds me to, um, before we close our show, I, that we got Spotify, which is another platform that's coming up uh, that will be available for artists, uh, you know, to uh, the platform for them to get out there. And, and that's good. And, and the Actually, CEO is going to help me. But a lot of artists get discouraged when they hear Spotify or something like that. Don't get discouraged. It's a simple process. It's a simple application process that you have to go through to get your music on there. Just have all your ducks in order. Okay. That's all. You know, because a lot of That's people, it. they think they make a song and they send it to iTunes. It has to be a certain quality, uh -huh. a certain grade. So look into that before you send your music out. Before, again, we close, uh, name of your radio station. Where, where can we find you? 
Uh, it's very simple. All you have to do is download the TuneIn uh, radio app. It's called TuneIn Radio. And once you download the okay. TuneIn Radio app, it's 100% free. Uh, once you download TuneIn, all you have to do is search for S as in Sam, D as in David, I as in Ingrid Radio, SDI Radio. And I'm live Monday through Friday, 12 to 2.30 p.m. I play music from the 80s, 90s. I play music that we haven't heard unless we go digging in the crates for an old CD or catch Channel 12 at 3 in the morning. So I like to play songs that we haven't heard for a while. And, you know, that's that's what I like to do. That's my format of music. So this way, everybody could feel like, uh, damn, I don't have to go buy a 70-year-old uh, CD from 70. I play that music for you. All you got to do is request it. And I'm live Monday through Friday, 12 to 2.30 p.m. And don't forget, I'm looking forward to, to seeing you once again. Live. Yes. I want to be live on the red carpet. Live. Physically yes. live. We are. And, and don't forget to check out that light page live on the red carpet. That's one of my like pages. So thank you so much. And uh, again, thank you for coming on to On the Red Carpet. Got live with Melissa D. Gordon. Anthony, the best to you. Thank you. I can't wait to uh, see your movie. Uh, read your book. And, and and all that. So keep in touch with us. And, 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 and we'll follow up with you so much. And again, you're uh, on the red carpet. Not live uh, with Anthony Quinones from Boricua Passe. Thank you so much. Much love, talk to you And like, comment, and share. And uh, you could be able to watch this on OTRC TV YouTube.